Oh, what's up everyone? Today is Monday, November 2nd at 8.14 a.m. Gonna do a video watch list today. So for those that don't know, I do a free video watch list every single Monday for the viewers on YouTube. And every single day or every other day, I try to do it for the members. Lately, not really many people have been watching these, which makes me discouraged to do them. So I mean, if you guys don't wanna watch them, then I, that means I probably shouldn't have to be doing them. So I don't know what I'm gonna keep doing with these video watch lists, but in the meantime, I'm guess I'm just going to do less and less as less people watch it. And you know, how can I be encouraged to keep doing these and taking my time to do them when no one really gives a shit about it? So anyway, uh, let's start. AMPC. This one looks kind of the most broken pre-market. So if I basically just draw my lines here, I'll kind of see this level called 480s. Just drawing. Let's So this is what I see so far on this stock, right? This is what I see. I see it's broken pre-market, right? Broken pre-market. VWAP is around 440, which is kind of close to that 450 half dollar mark. So looking for a morning bounce towards 440, 450 for an entry. Looking to add around 460, looking to add around 470. Uh, pretty much this one, I think it's gonna be broken. I think it's gonna stay broken. So if it kind of breaks under this line of 415, then I'm gonna look to short, you know, 430, 440, 450 because at that point it would be broken in my eyes that I don't think it's gonna to bounce to 460, 470, 480. So it depends on what it does in the morning. If it just tanks, looking to short 430, 440, 450. If it just goes straight up, 450, 460, 470. So that's that one. BLRX, I've been trading a little bit pre-market. Um, mm. If you look at the chart, you can see there is resistance. So previous support acts as resistance, which acts as resistance. So you can see the 250 line is very key, but yesterday, I mean on Friday, 230s and 240s were very key, which is kind of lining up again today, 230s, 240s. So in the morning I took a short 230, added to the winner when support broke, covered here, and now that it's under view app again, shorted some here with a plant at 230, 240, 250 in the morning. This is not one that I would chase weakness, rather waiting for pops on it. Um, DBVT is right here. As you can see, this is a death line setup. So I have my death line drawn and all I'm waiting for is it to break that death line and I will short it. If it bounces in the morning, I will draw my lines. So if it bounces in the morning, we'll short a bounce towards this level here, 280, 290 and stop out above three. Let's see what it does. I think this is gonna be a death line break, but we'll wait and see. And ISIG, not really much meat on the bone, so not really too interested. If this pops big, maybe, but not really in love with it. Um, today I'm gonna to do a YouTube live recap of my month. I made about $120,000 in October. So I'm gonna recap that today. And yeah, that's basically it, guys. So what I wanna do at the end of these videos is to make sure that you guys watch it till the very end. So I do like a secret word. So the secret word today is gonna to be pen. So comment that on the bottom of the video so I know that you watched it and that's basically it guys. I will see you in the room and let's have a great day.